How's it going everybody? So in this video, I am going to talk about how to stop biting your nails and make them grow faster. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do appreciate um, the support. It helps my channel grow. Uh, please follow me on Instagram, DylanBerg999. So biting your nails, I'm not gonna lie, um, I am bad. Look at my nails right now, they're pretty bad. This side's actually not too bad to be honest, but this side, um, kinda, kinda rough. Um, it is tough, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, it is tough to stop biting your nails. I went, I went at one point about four years in a row without biting any of my nails. I had perfect nail growth, I was cutting them all the time, and um, I started biting them again, which again, it's a, it's a hard, hard habit to really, really conquer, because they're right there. I mean, when you get nervous, anxious, right there, right there to bite them. Um, that's one thing about me. Um, like I do talk a lot, I make a lot of YouTube videos, like my current YouTube channel, I think I have probably about 3,600 videos on my other YouTube channel, I have about 1,400, I've probably made 5,000 YouTube videos. So I'm really, really comfortable talking in front of people. Um, in my day-to-day -day life, I am okay with talking with anyone. I'm not scared to go up to someone and start a random conversation. With that being said though, I am a pretty anxious person. I've always been anxious. I've always been kind of nervous little bit of social anxiety, always, since I was a kid, I was always, always like that shy, but I've kind of improved that over time. But I still have the urge sometimes when I get a little anxious to bite my nails. So I'm gonna tell you guys a simple, simple way to try to really beat this habit. And this is what I personally did for my four years without biting my nails. So the first thing that you wanna do is you wanna start eliminating fingers that you bite. So what I mean by this is, let's say you're trying to stop biting your fingers. You can bite any fingers on this hand, but this hand is off limits. So if you're ready to bite your fingers, just bite these ones. Do not touch these ones. Then what'll happen is over time, as you get better, only bite these four, and then these three, and then these two, and then just one. Just bite one finger and that's it. And eventually you will stop biting all your fingers. This is the easiest thing to do. I've done it all the time. The reason why it works is because you still get the feeling or the satisfaction of biting your nail, but you're not destroying all your fingers in the process. You're literally only biting one little nail. Um, what will happen is after a while, you'll stop biting altogether. The next thing that you wanna do is when you feel the need to bite your nails, play with your fingers, like kind of pull your finger, bend it, stuff like this. Like do anything with your fingers, whatever you wanna do, that's what I did. I just, instead of putting them in my mouth, um, my fingers in my mouth, I would just start like moving them around and doing stuff like that. It just, it, it's just like a fidgety thing, it helps. The next thing is to understand that your hands are covered in germs. And this is one that really allowed me, I think, in my opinion, to go all those years without biting them. Your hands right now, you can't see it, but they're covered with thousands of germs. Thousands of germs from touching the wall, touching my desk, touching this random pen, uh, just touching light switches. This is in my own house. Now imagine doing that in public. This is something I never do. I will never bite my fingers in public. I'll do it at home, but if I'm in public and I'm touching random doors and handles, I'll never put my fingers in my mouth. That is disgusting. And it's disgusting because of my mindset that there's all these different kinds of germs. So if you really just think about germs and bacteria on your fingers, you'll be less likely to chew on them. That's that's my tip, that's, that's what I would personally do. So end of video, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Uh, please follow me on Instagram, Dillenberg999.